Hello, boys and girls from the Lilac Room. Today I have a book where the main character is Matt Man. Some of my friends may remember Matt Man from our Learning Without Tears lessons. And remember the straight lines and curves. I'll send something to your parents so you can hear the Matt Man song. Well, today I'm going to be reading a book about Matt Man. That's why I was showing you the poster. And it's, this is Opposites, and it's by Jane Olson and illustrated by Molly Delaney. So let's get started. Matman. Matman stands. What's the opposite of stand? Matman sit. The opposite of stand is sit. He smiles. What's the opposite of smile? Did you say frown? Brown. Smile. Brown. Batman says up. There's up. And you say, what's the opposite of up? Did you say down? Down. Up. Down. Batman stands. I think we did this one already. What's the opposite? Sit. You're right. Batman whispers. What's a whisper? Whisper. What's the opposite of whisper? <gasps> Did you say shout? Yeah, shouting. That meant in. What's the opposite of in? Out. In, out. Those are opposites. That's when you know the difference between two things. That's what opposites are. Wet. What's the opposite of wet? Did you say dry? Wet, dry. Other opposites. That man says, laugh. Uh oh. Did you say cry? There's laugh and cry. That man, there he is. He's stand. Remember this one? Sit. Oh, looks like he's at the beach enjoying himself. That man says, push. Push. So he's getting a push on the sled. Opposite of push is pull. These little doggies are pulling the dog sled. That man says empty. Empty. Did you say full? Full. Empty. Full. That's the opposite. You're comparing the two different ones. That man says, oh, this is old. What's the opposite of old? New. It's like a new, nice new barn. Batman says, many. We've got many little chicks. You know what the opposite of many? Do you say few? Few. Few. There's just a couple of little lambs, but lot, many chicks. Batman, there he stands up again. There he is. Stand. What's the opposite of stand? Sit. All right. Um, Man says real, so he's on a real horse. You know what the opposite of real is? Pretend. Oh, the little stick horses. We have those at our yard too. That's peaceful. That man says start, start, and end, and that's the end of this book. So start, end. Opposites are everywhere. They are. They're everywhere. See if you can find some that make a pair. Well, I have a few here that I want to show you. I'm going to share with you. Let's see if you could compare to these two different things. So this is dirty. What do you think the opposite is for dirty? Do you say clean? Dirty, clean. Those are opposites. How about this? This is open, open. What is the opposite of open? Closed, open, closed. Those are opposites. How about this one? This one is, this helicopter is together, together. And now it is apart. So together, and now it is apart. Together, apart. Two, those are opposites. Here's an easy one. This is the front of the bear. What's the opposite of front? Did 
Did you say back, front, back, opposite? How about this? Full. What's the opposite of full? Did you say empty? Empty. Full. Empty. How about this one? This little man. Little Lego man is on top. He's on. He's on. On. So now he is off. On. Off. It's like a light switch. On. Off. Those are opposites. How about this one? This one is little cars going up. What's the opposite of up? Do you say down? Up, down, opposites. Here's a little tricky one. This is thin, thin. What's the opposite of thin? Thick. So can you see the difference? Thin, thick. That's the opposite. And my last one, long. What's the opposite of long? Did you say short? Long, short. Well, those are opposites. I bet you could find some all around your house. You could play a little game with your uh, brothers or sisters or your mom or dad or anybody who's, who's in, living with you. Well, uh, stay safe, my friends. Until next time. Bye-bye.